Hey everyone, this is Safwan and welcome to my channel. Today is going to be a quick tutorial on business process flow and in particular the flow steps permissions. So you might have a case where um, you've got a business process flow and it has a flow step, but what happens is if someone runs it um, and you might have another person coming in to check whether the flow step has completed or not, they won't be able to see the result. And this is because um, your system jobs permission. So if you have a look at our roles here, we have the system job permission, which is at the moment uh, specific to the user. So if this user, user SK, um, runs the flow step, um, if, and if someone else comes in and tries to look at the result, they won't be able to see it because it's linked to this user and not the other one. So uh, in this example, um, I've got two users. So one is the GP user, one is the SK user. And I'll just quickly demonstrate to you the issue that I'm talking about. So I've, I've got this flow step and I'm just going to rerun this again. And just to make sure that over here, we uh, don't have a result. So that's that. Let's run this. And then obviously this is now processing and we can have a look at obviously the ID is uh, 2032, ID is 2032. And if we refresh this, you'll see that the flow step is succeeded. However, in here, if I refresh this, you won't see the result, right? Um, and this is because of this security role. So to enable everyone to see the results of a business process flow flow step, um, all you need to do is uh, come to your role and turn this into an organization level setting. Now, this is a custom role I have. Most of the time the system customizes a role. Um, this would be all organization level. Um, I have copied this role over from, I think, either a basic role or a system um, or like an environment maker role. And they normally have this system job as um, a user level permission. So if I come here and if I save this, and if I jump back to my work order and let's rerun this, so I'm just gonna And the flow is just a test flow, by the way. There is one, two steps, um, one that receives the flow step and the other one that just changes the result. Okay, so that's all succeeded. Let me just refresh this. And you can see that, okay, that's succeeded. Now, if I come back here and if I refresh this, hopefully the permissions have taken place. And voila, it's succeeded. So that's all. Um, if you liked it, please give a thumbs up. And yeah, if you have any questions, reach out. Thanks.